Hello everyone, welcome to watch session 6, Database Storage through MQTT. In this session, we will show you how to store data in MySQL Server by MQTT Broker. The software we are going to use is Highwell Data Interconnection Tool. This software will transmit the data from MQTT Broker to MySQL Server or SQL Server. The first step is configure the MQTT server. Click on the top left hand side, we can define the MQTT server. The host should be the MQTT broker your MGMI connected to. You can check the IP address of MQTT server in our network session. The IP address will be 192. 168.0.104 and the port is default as 1883 and we can also enable the validation here and then click OK. So now we finish the configuration of MQTT server. Now we are going to add a new task. Add a task and click on setting. And give a name here and the project identifier will be the same as you created in your HMI project. You can also check on the last session. The project identifier will be video tutorial. And the quality of service I choose the highest. And we can fit in the information of your database here. We support MySQL and Microsoft SQL Server. Now I'm going to fit in the IP address of my MySQL Server 47.111.9. The default port is 3306 and username is root. And then I'm going to enter the password of my, my SQL server. And then I can choose a database. If this database is not existing in your MySQL server, it will be created. And then add a group identifier. This group identifier should be the same as your HMI project. So I fill in group one here. Then click on OK. Now we finish the setting for my SQL server in High World Data Interconnection Tool. After that we can click on start. Now the data will be transmitted to my SQL server. Now I'm using software MySQL front to visit my MySQL server. As you can see here a new table group one is created. And we can find that the data of HMI is transmitted to database continuously. 